Hello, everyone, and thank you for coming back to Deb Chanel's 48th World, where we do news, entertainment news, regular news, breaking news. We have an exclusive, updated um, history on um, the asthma, uh, asthma attack that actually confirms why Precious Harris uh, crashed her car into a utility pole. And subsequently died after said injuries. But well, we get it. Uh, I get the story exclusively from TMZ. It reads: Ti's sister, Precious Harris, asthma attack triggered accident. Police report confirms. Uh, it says Ti's sister, Ti's older sister, Precious Harris, had an asthma attack on the road, which led to her crashing her vehicle and untimely losing her life. According to the Atlanta PD traffic accident report obtained by TMZ, T.I.'s grandniece, Carrie Chapman, was riding passenger, or was the riding passenger with Precious behind the wheel when Precious suffered an asthma attack. They were in T.I.'s 2013 Dodge Avenger. Carrie went on to tell cops that Precious passed out and veered into a telephone pole. The responding officer says Precious was unconscious when he arrived, noting she was breathing but beginning to foam at the mouth. Paramedics eventually arrived and took her to the to a hospital. Cop says Carrie was treated by EMS after complaining of chest pains but was later released. The report says both the front driver's side and front passenger side airbags were deployed. TMZ broke the story. Precious died Friday after just over a week in the ICU unit and on life support. T.I. and his wife, Tiny, shut down production of their show, Friends and Family Hustle, as soon as they heard about the accident. Her daughter wrote, From my best friend on earth to my beautiful angel in heaven, I love you so much. I'm so heartbroken. But the way you look so at peace this past week has confirmed that you are resting. No more asthma attacks. Damn, but babe, I'm going to miss you. T.I. also commented on his sister's death saying, we love you dearly, baby girl. Okay, now that was the updated news, uh, breaking news on T.I.'s sister, Precious Harris, on what caused her death uh, in such an untimely manner. You know, when he first reported it, um, it was speculation going on to, you know, uh, you know, she just veered off the road. Uh, it was a sacrifice. Uh, you know, she was drinking and driving. So now all those little uh, reports or uh, gossiping knickknackers putting stuff out there uh, on the tube and, and news media. She died because she had an asthma attack. Now, my final thoughts on the matter is I wonder why she was behind the wheel anyway. Uh, when definitely it kind of seems like that's a hazard to the road. You know, like some people who have like very low vision, they can't drive. And of course, you know, you have the elderly community. If they over 60 something, say 65, 66, and um, they're not really good at seeing, you know, they kind of get a temporary pass to be driving, but it needs to be somebody else in the car with them, you know, because that can be a hazard to themselves as well as other people out there on the road. So, and ep um, people who have uh, um, epileptic seizures, they tend to not have the privilege to drive as well because anytime, you know, a seizure can come on them at any time. So I'm thinking, you know, uh, did her doctor really suggest that she shouldn't drive and she was having, you know, a lot of asthma attacks or was it just one that triggered you know, just out the open, but, you know, I commend her, uh, definitely for, uh, noticing she was having one, and maybe that was the nearest thing she could do to stop the car, uh, how her brain may have been, um, uh, letting her know, or shutting down, uh, to just hit a pole, and thank God had his angels around the whole car, and in the car, because it could have been two fatalities, um, don't know how old the girl was, uh, that was riding in the passenger seat, but that does shine some light on it and take it out of a stigma type basis or what people were saying could have happened. 
Uh, so still a bad situation, irregardless, um, that might try to uh, teach other people who are asthma sufferers. If, you know, asthma attack can be triggered so easily on you from your past experiences, maybe you shouldn't drive. You know, that should be a caution tale that you should talk over with your family members as well as your doctor. You know, should you be driving? Uh, or, you know, disabled in that way of driving and letting someone else drive for you. I know we love our independence. We want to get and go and do what we want to do when we feel like it. But on the side of caution and error, we want to make sure we're not endangering other people as well. So that was the update that TMZ reported it. Uh, reported on T.I.'s um, sister, Precious Harris. Keep that family in your prayers because um, they're definitely going to miss her, and especially all the kids that kind of had with T.I. Uh, that she was privy on taking care of, such as Major. You know, Major was probably all Boo Bear and Damani and um, King and Dejanay, uh Dardasia, and, you know, the other ones I can't really name at this time. But keep them all in your prayers uh, daily, weekly, monthly, however, when you just think about them at times or you think about T.I. and your mind may wander to his sister. So I'm sure he's going to need and uh, is thankful for all our prayers and condolences uh, where we pray when it's two or more. The Lord is always with us and he's willing to grant sincere prayers. OK, so y'all um, be Cool with one another, love on each other, and I'll see you next video. Bye-bye.